Dude, you look freaking amazing. Dude, look how handsome you are. Oh yeah, bud. <laughs> Holy guacamole. How do you walk in this thing? Give a twirl. Give it. You got the veil. Yep, the, the veil, veil came. came. <laughs> Dude, you look amazing. Thank you. Oh. Mm. You doing look good? Yeah. All right. Now that the veil's on my yeah, head. <laughs> There was one time Jordan and Carl were driving from one of their nomad locations to another and made a stop at my house. Carl literally slept outside in the car so that Jordan and I could talk and have our girl time alone. Yeah, he started telling me about this girl he met junior year and he really talked about her like, like no one he had ever talked about before. She told me how, how she was so smart. She was an engineer, which I was really impressed with. There aren't a lot of couples that you can hang out with that don't make you feel even slightly like the third wheel. But Jordan and Carl are one of them. Uh, how, how gorgeous she was, and she even lived by the England factory, so you know she was the total package. The more I got to know Carl, the more excited I was for him to be marrying my best friend. So even though you are probably one of the weirdest people I have ever met, I am so glad you and Jordan found each other. A lot of planning went into this day. Is that fair to say? Being at distance from one another, yet you did all the planning? I'm, I'm not sure I agree with that. I, I seem to recall a different version of this story, but we can talk about that later. Might be a bomb. It might be a bomb. <laughs> but all those details, all those plans, I want you to set aside, and I want you to do one thing together today. Be together. Noog? You're gonna run out of mugs? <laughs> <laughs> zoom in. You can never have too many. Maybe not show your mom. She'll oh, be on my awesome. <laughs> <laughs> already look like that. Jordan and I have been best friends since high school when we met on our soccer team. Looking back, one could probably guess we would be lifelong buddies considering we spent hours in Jordan's basement rehearsing goal celebrations. One, two, three, go. Carl and I grew up pretty much connected at the hip, if uh, you guys don't know me. From the school halls, to the pool decks, to the tennis courts, we're pretty much inseparable. Uh, I think we even won best bromance for our high school superlatives. I am so grateful to have Jordan in my life, and it is really nice feeling to know that we will always be there for each other, no matter the distance or the circumstances. Even if it's been a while since we've seen each other, we always pick up right where we left off. Ooh, my heart is beating. Ooh. Of course, there are rumors around, going around, that we were a couple and everything. Uh. You guys can't prove anything. That video's been long deleted. <laughs> <laughs> I had to do it. I had to do it. <laughs> this is what we expected. We're leaving now. And <laughs> yeah, now we're running away. <laughs> That's more high heely. <laughs> oh my god. I look pretty. You look beautiful. <laughs> you look so We can't beautiful. kiss, right? Why not? We can kiss. Are we allowed to kiss? Yes. <laughs> Your love made this happen. Brought you two together, brought all this crowd here, your friends standing up here. And we are all honored to be here. And we rejoice in this day. Your love, your presence together will get you through this best of days. And this is going to be a best day. Then along comes Carl. I love Carl and I was nagging him about when he was going to propose to Jordan. Because I know he's a great guy and I know he's right for her. Up to this point, Carl had never been really in a serious relationship with anyone um, until Jordan came along. I know how much he loves her, how well he treats her, how he will make her laugh every day for the rest of her life. You two are both such awesome, incredible people, and I know your life together is going to be a truly amazing journey. So I felt confident handing Carl off to this girl. She could definitely outperform me, for sure. In all serious though, you guys are made for each other. I'm so happy to be here celebrating everything with you.
Let's toast a lifetime bursting with love and happiness to our stunning newlyweds. Congratulations to the new Mr. and Mrs. Saucy. You read it out loud? How long is yours? Pretty long. It's a novel. It's a novel. I don't want to start crying either. Don't cry. <laughs> I don't have any tissues. Oh my goodness. Meet you at the end of the aisle. Yes. I'll see you there. <sighs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> mm -hmm. Watch the veil. I love you. I love you too.